This video is, is used to show you how to set up an offer uh, in the system. I'm going to do two versions of the offer setup to show you a fast version just to get going and then I'll do a more detailed uh, video on all the options that are in the offer. So to get an offer going you're going to go up to offers, new offer. Now if I'm going to interface to a third party tracking system I'm going to match their offer ID or campaign ID or whatever to the to the uh, offer ID here. I'm not doing that so I'm just going to call this health insurance, name it health insurance. I am going to record calls. I'm going to base everything in Eastern time zone. I'll go over callback behavior later. Uh, I'm going to go over um, greetings and everything later. So I'm going to delete the greeting. And I'm just going to do the when one is pressed. Don't worry about it. I'll explain how it still follows when one is pressed when the consumer doesn't know they're supposed to press one, but leave it like this. So normally you just need to forward calls to buyers and I'm either going to list the buyers that are in a group here or I'm going to list the individual buyers here and you just keep clicking on that line and keep adding buyers until you're done and then down here is basically what you're going to pay your publishers for calls. So I'm going to call this a default payout and I'm going to say that I'm only buying traffic from ad networks, so I'm never paying for calls. For this quick setup, I'm just going to say the payout zero. I'm converting calls to my publisher at 60 seconds, and I deep calls to my publishers for 30 days. So I'm just calling each call unique for 30 days, only if it lasted 60 seconds or longer, not paying for calls at all. And I'm not going to work, worry about outgoing web works or how the optimizer works at this time. But that's how you set up an offer to route calls to from your publishers to your buyers. What you will be doing after you create an offer is you will have to keep adding the buyers for this offer under the buyer's maintenance. And then in the offer's maintenance, keep adding it to the press one line right here. So just adding a buyer to our system does not get it calls. We have to know which offer the buyer belongs to or offers. He can belong to multiple offers.